Um, welcome to Ghost Hunting 101. Um, this is the first time that this has ever been filmed with a crew, so hopefully um, it goes better than our usual uploads. I don't think it's going to go very well. Optimism. What did we say about talking during my, during my lines? I don't know. Did I say we couldn't talk during my lines? Crap. <laughs> At the right moment? You're not supposed to talk during my lines, guys. Oh, our bad. Do I have you for two days or three days? Is this God! Oh, you're, you're in the shop. Get out of the shop. Sorry. Okay. Oh, um. <laughs> yeah, we're ready. Oh, hi. My name is Susan. I've been working for about two years now. Um, as you can see, I took my job very seriously. Do we see that? You do see that. Okay. My name is John Vittenheim the Victorious. The third. And I am, I have uh, many, many degrees, many, and by that I mean one, uh, in film and media studies. I don't know why I'm here. Hi, I'm Salem. I'm a freelance graphic designer. Originally, I just made the flyers to recruit people, but uh, after seeing the people that got recruited... What do you mean after seeing the people that got recruited? Are we not good enough for you? Guys, please, can we not fight during the interviews? It wasn't even my fault. They started it. Get yeah, you out, need to get out. out. Get. As for experience, there is none. I don't believe in ghosts. I've worked part-time at Walmart, and trust me, there's a lot more terrifying things than the undead. The only thing I am worried about is how Hunter got my email. We don't talk about that? What do you mean? I said we don't talk about it. How did you do that? Nothing. It's nothing. not important. Susan? Susan? The experience? Oh, um, as for experience, I would say I have about two seconds of experience when a squirrel decided to crawl into my bathtub. I'm sorry, wait, what? Yeah, I thought it was a ghost, so I'd say that counts as experience. How, how is a ghost, how is a squirrel a ghost? It just is. That When you think it's a ghost, it just is a ghost. And did you talk to the squirrel? A little bit. You are not a princess, that is it's physically impossible. What, what are you doing? What was? Who let her bring this in here? I am a princess. Uh, uh, no, where'd you get that? Disneyland? No. Okay, where? My prince, of course. Oh my. All right, guys. All right. Um. I guess we're ready to go. So, do you want to get stuff ready? I don't set. Oh, things. you oh. got it. You set things up. Got hey. guy. What? Hey, jeez. Do you not understand that you're- I hired you to do something? No. <laughs> and there she goes. Okay, do you got it? <sighs> Are you going to do something here? No. On this I wasn't I trained on this equipment. I don't know why you, she expects me. Do you need me to help you with it? No. <laughs> Can you record, please? Fine. Okay. Thank you. All right, and welcome back to Ghost Hunting 101. Um, today we are at a school, which is one of my favorite spots to go to, actually. Um, wow. Okay, that's more activity than I usually see here in the mornings or afternoons. I am losing track of time with this chaotic group. Um, anyways, uh, most of the settings here, um, since it is a school, most kid. Ghosts are actually most active here, but there's sites of actually older figures too. And what are you doing on my property? What the I, heck? I have never seen you before, sir. Of course you haven't seen me. A lot of folks haven't seen me. That's the point of being a manager, to make sure folks don't see you. I'm sorry, do you work here? Of course I work here. Otherwise I wouldn't be coming to bother you, now would I? Okay, well, uh, maybe he didn't deliver the message, but uh, I got the owner's permission to film here like all night. Well, then show me the paperwork, then. Why do I need to show you? Because I'm the manager. I've never heard of you. Tim never mentioned you. That's because I am Tim. People call me Tim Burt, the property manager. You know what? How about I actually call him right now to actually... No, no, don't call him! That's an imposture you got there. All right? Uh-huh. There's a reason I always wear a tinfoil hat every time I sleep. You know, um, I actually have the papers to film here. You know, it's actually right here. So, um... Okay, you're good. 
Please don't tell me he's coming. He's gonna come back. All right, welcome everyone. We are back at a haunted playground. And theories have shown that in the 1700s, this actually was an orphanage that Ooh. burned down. Thank you. <laughs> and, and actually, what are they doing? What? That what is that? What, right now. Now. what are you doing? Wait. Right. Look. Ew. So rude. Guys, what did I talk to? This you is Susan the Third now. You named it? Of course I did. What about Fred? Guys, I told it's you Susan the Third. I told you that Ew. stuff here could be possessed and I told you not to touch it. When did you mention that? In the memo that I what emailed memo? I emailed it to you. When? Last week. Uh. <laughs> what are you Whoa. doing on my property? Oh god, he's back. What do you want? <laughs> You we already left. We what do you think I want? I want you off my property. You said Your was... property was the school. You said it at the school, and I told you I had the permit. So rude. This is ah, my memory must be failing me again. <laughs> I, I'm Herbert, the property manager. How can I help you today? I talked I'm to not you. taking my doll. I talked to you last week on the phone. We already had this organized. Uh, I, I suffer from partial uh, d dementia. It's no big deal. Uh, so, oh. what's your name again? Susan Hunter. Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, Hunter. Uh, if you don't get off my property in 15 minutes, there will be a consequence. We compromised in an hour last week. Awkward. Oh my gosh, okay. He tried to take my doll. Yeah, because it's not yours. It's left here. It needs Susan. to be possessed. I mean, it is free. That's what I'm saying. Why are you- John, Susan, just put the doll back. Put the doll back. No. Can I finish my monologue about this place? Because it- I mean, An orphanage not... burned down here. That could be one of the children's toys that got left here, and it could be haunted by the- They don't need it. Wouldn't the children's toys have gotten destroyed if there was a fire? Exactly. That's why, if it looks in like this good condition, it could be possessed. Anyone but think I... of that? It could be somebody's. Just put it back. Just, even if it's not possessed, it could be a kid's toy, and if we take it, I don't want to have a call from their mom. What they gonna do? Cry? We don't have you wanna... seen Karen's these days? Yeah, we don't want a crying child. Oh, not again. I'll cry if I put it back. Please, put the top back. We have other places to go to. John. <sighs> We're going. Could have been a modern art piece. John, what is wrong with you? I'm just saying. Where is she going? <sighs> All right, um, I'll see everyone at site three, I guess. Uh, Susan. Why are we running? All right, this is our last location of the night, everyone. Um, this is a this is a forest. Um, severely haunted. There's been a lot of disappearances here. Uh, multiple sightings of very different age groups. So uh, it's very easy to actually get lost in this place. So everyone hey. has to stick. What? Where'd Susan go? I was just talking about this. Susan. Can someone look for her? Oh. Susan! Yeah. Susan! 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 Ah! Frick, Susan. I... I shouldn't have... Oh, I lost everyone. Jesus Christ. Okay, Susan. Uh. Holy... Guys! 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 Uh, uh, um... We gotta go. What do you we mean? just gotta go. Did, what about Susan? She's um, she's not coming back with us. I never liked her anyways. Let's go. <laughs> you just gotta, you gotta promise me to not talk about this at all, ever again, and we'll be fine. Okay. It'll be fine. Fair yeah. Sure. <laughs> Let's go back to the car. <laughs> Hey, I didn't see you came by that night. Did something come up? Hey, um, actually your night guard kept, like, kicking us out. We don't have a night guard. I, he might have been new, but, like, this guy named Herbert, he kept saying he, like, knew you, was a property manager, like, was just everywhere. No, we, we don't have a night guard, especially one named Herbert. I mean... Do you guys have a property manager? He said he was a property manager, and he said he was the owner. He said he was you. Uh, I can't, the, the only person related to the park named Herbert died like 50 years ago. 
Hello? Hello?